Hello, this is John back again with another product review for you and not you. Today, I'm going to be doing another uh, video where I taste limited edition Lay's chips. And these are iconic restaurant flavors. That's exactly how it's spelled on the bag because these are European. European See, Flave Hours. Subway Teriyaki. KFC Original Recipe Chicken. And the pizza that everyone likes. Pizza Hut Margarita. Flave Hour. Anytime you go to Pizza Hut, you want to get the margarita. Iconic. Restaurant flavors, ladies and gentlemen. And each one of these has a two-for-one coupon on the bag. I'm assuming that's only for European restaurants. Let's go ahead and start with Subway Teriyaki. I've had the Subway Teriyaki chicken before. It's pretty good. It's probably one of the real, the best of the healthy ones they have. I got a picture right there. Like the sesame seed bun, green peppers, and red onions, and tomatoes, and spinach. Almost looks like there's corn on there. Does Subway in Europe put corn on their sandwiches? Tell me, like, what are those little yellow dots that are coming out of there? Maybe it's like mustard that's oozing out, but they really look like kernels of corn. They look like kernels of corn to me. And mute the computer from beeping at me. Let's go smell. It definitely smells like a flavored chip. Yes, another interesting thing. These are ridged. Lay's in Europe has ridged chips. We just have the crappy wavy ones here. That's a lot of flavor. It really doesn't look like it has tons of seasoning on it. But when I eat it, it's like... It hits you. I love how the ridge ones are. They're really thick and crunchy. I was going to about to uh, read the ingredients on here, but it only has it listed in um, what's the uh, what's a Netherlands language? It has it looks like it has Belgian mm -hmm. and whatever the language is in the Netherlands. I know they also call it Holland. Hollandish, Netherlandsish, Hollandese. I don't know. Tell me in the con comments below. What is the language of Holland or the Netherlands? Now, even though this came from the Netherlands, every country in the European Union area that I know of is the same three flavors. These are really good. It's like this combination of sweet, salty, and tangy. Almost like it has a little acidicness to it, like a Maybe balsamic or some kind of wine vinegar. I 
I wish I knew where any of these words mean. I'm assuming our dapples is a potato. And the Belgian one, it says palms de terre. Hmm. Let's say teriyaki. Sucrose. Dextrose. Acidic. Acide citric. Mm hmm. And cayenne pepper. In, in the Netherlands language, it's teriyaki snack. It's really just teriyaki and then S M A A K. Teriyaki smack. Sounds like a drug. Hello. I didn't think Subway Teriyaki would be my favorite of these three, but I'm overwhelmed with how much I really enjoy this flavor. Let's go ahead and move on to Pizza Hut Margarita Flavor. Again, two for one coupon. Has a tomatoy smell to it. Lay's has made a bunch of different pizza flavors. They have a the regular pizza flavor. They had the Chicago deep dish pizza flavor. I think they had like a New York pizza flavor. But this should taste like Pizza Hut. That does look like a Pizza Hut pizza though. Yeah, crispy orange chip. There's a bit of a a zippy tomato flavor. But compared to the the amount of flavor from the teriyaki subway flavors, this is just it's so light. Let's see if there's anything I can read out of here. Ah. Just like the other one had teriyaki smack, this one has pizza smack. Oh, I see milk and boater milk. I think I can figure out those are. Paprika extract? Oregano? Okay, and what does... This one has it in French. Bus base aromatis aroma tisante au goût de pizza. Tomate et el and poudre. Persil paprika. There is another word. Colorants. So there's some color in there. It's a little tomatoey, and that's about what I, what I fl taste on this one. The pizza will have one, hmm. not the best, not terrible, but uh, if I'm considering ones that are like really unique and I like, this one's not it. Lastly, this is the one that I had the highest hopes for. KFC original recipe chicken. See if there's any, uh, there's a Kentucky Fried Chicken Smack. That's exactly what it says. Kentucky Fried Chicken, S-M-A-A-K. Milk, milk powder, paprika. There's paprika in all these. They must just love paprika over there. Mm-hmm. See what the French one says. It's 
SPCs, which I think is spices. Protein de soja. Nope, can't read anything else. Let's see what looks like what they say. First of all, does it smell like KFC? It smells kind of peppery. Doesn't really look like there's a lot of stuff on it. It has more flavor than it looks like. Is that KFC? So there's... It tastes like there's two competing flavors in this. You get this... You start off tasting this like mild... savoriness but then the more you eat and the more you chew it up you just get this black pepper flavor and I think those specks are not huge chunks but like for chips decent sized pieces of black pepper I think big enough that when you're chewing them and you break into one of those pieces it's a big enough piece that it has some uh, oils of pepper still inside one of the reasons why fresh ground pepper is so much better than pepper out of a shaker is because when you break that pepper corn you have the oils that are on the inside that gets released And I think some of these pepper pieces are big enough that they're really holding on to some intense pepper flavor. And the more you eat, the more it's just pepper. That one's disappointing. So, if I were going to put these in order of how I like them, we'll go reverse. This one's the worst. It kind of tastes like pepper and burnt potatoes. I can honestly say I don't like that one. Second, going from worst to best, is the Pizza Hut Margarita Flavor. This Flavor... It's not bad. It tastes like tomatoey, with a little bit of zippiness to it. Maybe some uh, buttermilky, maybe some vinegary type flavors to it. It's not bad, but it's not any different or better than some of the other pizza flavored chips that Lay's has come out in the United States. Far and away, the best chip of this bunch is Subway Teriyaki. From the minute I first put one in my mouth, I was very much surprised how flavorful it was. It just had this blend of balsamic-y or maybe wine vinegary flavor. But then there was also maybe like some soy or some other competing things. And they all mixed together and they blended very well. And the ridged chip on here... Subway, Subway, this is a Subway, the Lay's in the United States, get rid of those crappy waves, give us the ridges, they're better, they're crunchier, they're crispier, they're more dippable, give us the Lay's with the ridges, get rid of the Lay's with the waves, that's all I'm saying, and also, bring this Subway teriyaki flavor to the United States, this is delicious, I would buy more, anyway, 
Hope you enjoyed this video of these three flavors only available in Europe. Subway, Pizza Hut, and KFC. If you are in the UK or the European areas and you've tried these, let me know what you think in the comments below. Which one you like the best. Um, and if there's other, other European chip flavors out there that you think I should try. With that, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.